contrary to popular belief, black holes don't suck. They're not these cosmic vacuum cleaners that are pooling in matter from really far away. So what are they? Well, essentially, black holes are just really dense objects whose gravity is so powerful that not even light can escape them. But in order to get trapped by a black hole, you have to get close to it. The point of no return is called the event horizon. Once you're inside the event horizon, the escape velocity needed to get away from the black hole is faster than the speed of light. But as long as you're outside the event horizon, you could, in theory, escape from the black hole. It's not going to suck you in. When we talk about how big black holes are, we're talking about the diameter of the event horizon. The supermassive black hole in the center of the Milky Way has a diameter of 16 million miles, or 26 million kilometers. It's a big region where you would get trapped by it. But a black hole the mass of the sun would only have a diameter around 3 kilometers, a bit under 2 miles across. When you are far away from that event horizon, the black hole's gravity is going to act like any other massive object. If our sun were to be replaced by a black hole of the same mass, Earth would just keep going around in its normal orbit. We wouldn't be sucked into it. And even if you're much closer to the event horizon than Earth is to the sun, in this region we call the accretion disk, you're not guaranteed to fall into the black hole. When we take images of supermassive black holes like this one, we are seeing light that is coming from the accretion disk. This is energy that is able to escape from just outside the black hole. If a black hole was truly sucking in everything around it, we wouldn't be able to see the accretion disk. 